Welcome back to the 1991 LEGO Formula 1 World Championship. We are at the Hockenheim Ring for the German Grand Prix, and our 13 drivers are ready to go to start this event. Drivers like Gerhard Berger and Michael Schumacher are looking to take the victory at their home Grand Prix today, with everybody looking to find points for this championship as we wind down. A side event has happened between two drivers, Ayrton Senna and Alain Prost, after the British Grand Prix. We have a replay of a little bit of a verbal and physical scrum between the two of them. You will see here Prost and Senna getting into it a little bit. Officials got in between them and decided to offer Ayrton Senna a five-spot grid penalty for today's race. But let's look at the rest of the starting lineup first. Pole position for today's race is Gerhard Berger. Starting second will be Nigel Mansell. Third place for Michael Schumacher. And rounding out the top four, it's Alain Prost. Starting off row three, it's Nelson Piquet alongside Damon Hill. And in seventh position, Ayrton Senna with what I think is a ridiculous penalty alongside Ivan Capelli in the Leighton House. Ninth position on the grid is Mauricio Gujumin in the other Leighton House. And alongside of him, it's Derek Warwick. Starting 11th, Jean Alessi, and in 12th, it's Olivier Grouillard. Grid position number 13 today will go to Mika Hakkinen. Alright, thank goodness we're ready to go racing. And the lights are out, and they're underway. Nigel Mansell got that early jump, and he's going to hold Gerhard Berger back in second position. Third place is Michael Schumacher as they come through the chicane for the first time. Oh, car in the wall! It's Nelson Piquet. Slid a little wide through that chicane, and he hit the wall. His day's done for that Benetton. Mansell's still holding on to that lead. Now he's got a huge jump. Whoa, look at this! It's Prost and Senna in the barriers again. Oh, and they're tangling up with each other. Getting in a little bit of an argument up there. Mansell has completed two of the scheduled three laps now, as Gugjelmin's got a blown tire. And there goes Grouillard into the wall! A half a lap left in this high attrition race for Nigel Mansell. No, and his motor's gone! The Williams is beached at the far end of the racetrack as Gerhard Berger has assumed the lead from the scenario and will take it to the finish line. Gerhard Berger has won the German Grand Prix! Especially heartbroken for Nigel Mansell, though. Look at him. He is in complete shock at what has just happened. So here we are now with the podium. Gerhard Berger, Michael Schumacher, and Damon Hill. Hopefully you've enjoyed this very hectic German Grand Prix and look forward to coming back next time at Monza for the Italian Grand Prix, which will be the final race that Joe Donahue decides to take the time to make. So it will be the conclusion of our championship. Once again, hopefully you enjoyed. Congratulations, Gerhard, on your first victory. And we will see you in Monza for the finale.